renowned restaurateurs, Mr. and Mrs. Jacques Tretchen, owners of Fay Caraibs, have conceptualized and cooked up what they're calling the Fay Vefort or FVF Club to serve up potential solutions to regulators and also support business development in the South. Our idea is because I meet all of you uh, together, each investor in St. Lucia at Vieux and most of them have some questions about the, what's happened, what we're doing, uh, I want to do that, and some few of us have no answer, but what's the people of France doing? Put everybody around the table because this is our best in France, cooking, drinking, and share friendless. So this is what we're doing tonight, and the purpose of that dinner is to share with the Honorable Mr. First Minister, Mrs. Honorable, Mrs. Emma Hippolyte, and Mr. Kenny, who is representative of Vieux to our best thing we have in Vieux but also what we have some questions, we have some uh, interrogation of your amazing plan you have. Investor confidence in St. Lucia is making a roaring return under the stewardship of Prime Minister Honorable Philip J. Pierre. Honorable Pierre gave his support to the emerging FVF club at its inaugural meeting, which was also attended by some of Vefor and St. Lucia's most prominent business leaders. We know you went through some very tough times through COVID. I want to thank all the businesses that stayed afloat during COVID. And I, I know it was rough, it was very rough, but you stayed afloat, I want to thank you for it. And now we see signs of progress. You see signs of improvement. Our tourism industry is, is improving. In fact, last week, we, last Sunday, we, we welcomed over 1,500 visitors to St. Lucia, which is the same number we have during the, the, the winter season, during January. So we did very well. And, that, and we, we believe that these figures remain till the end of September. So the signs are there, and we want to encourage it. We want to create the enabling environment to allow you to expand and to develop and to make the South what it can be and what it should be. Commerce Minister Honorable Emma Hippolyte has welcomed the opportunity to interface and engage the FVF Club to address areas of mutual concern. I am pleased that we have this gathering here. I am hoping that it can be something that we can have periodically so that we can engage. It is important because the Prime Minister will tell you that as a government, we believe that the public sector is important for us. Um, we know that you are going through significant struggles, but the government that you have is a government that have sat and committed um, to work with you. Member of Parliament for V4 South and former Prime Minister, Honorable Dr. Kenny Anthony, has expressed excitement over the burgeoning commercial expansion prospects on offer in his constituency. One of the things that has gladdened my heart over the years is the fact that we were accustomed in Vieux for businesses to come from Castries to Vieux and establish in Vieux Now is the reverse. Vieux Fortians are going up to the north to establish businesses. And Louis, of course, has had a business in Cullisac, one of the pioneers of development in Cullisac, thanks at the time to the fact that we had declared Cullisac a special development <laughs> area. Yeah. So, you know, I mean, there are new possibilities. Mr. and Mrs. Jacques Tretchen's Fay V4 Club has extended an invitation to the island's southern-based businesses to consolidate ideas and efforts to continue nourishing the South's economic landscape. From the office of the Prime Minister, Rihani Isidore.